and welcome to my YouTube channel once again. Yay! <laughs> if this is your first time stopping by on this channel, hello, hi! My name is Trezor, and as you can see, I am super excited. I tend to act like a little girl when I'm super excited. <laughs> So all the excitement juices are flowing, but my name is Trezor and I'm so excited that you stopped by on my channel. And if you're a returning subscriber, you know what I say. I love you guys. I appreciate you. Thank you so much for liking my videos. Thank you for sharing them. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for hyping your girl up. You guys make me so happy when you get excited that I post posted a new video. Oh man, it just brings so much joy to my face. So thank you for all of you that have been real OG subscribers supporters and all of that jazz i love you guys i appreciate you please keep doing the things that you do all right now as you can see from the title of this video today, I am talking about five things that I absolutely love about a Marilis hotel. Um, and these five things are things that I think make it unique from any other hotel. Now, before I get into that, I want to give a big shout out to a Marilis hotel and um, their general manager for allowing me to use this beautiful space of theirs and just for partnering with Malawian brands and um, they've, they're big, big, big supporters of uh, Malawian art. And I mentioned this in my previous video. If you haven't watched it, what you're waiting for? <laughs> in my prayer for Malawi video, I spoke about how um, they have, they just, they support the Malawian brand. So thank you to Amerilis. Thank you to all um, the staff members that work here at Amerilis. And thank you uh, for just your management and the amazing things that you do. All right, let's get into the content of the day. I listen, if you have not been to Amerilis, if you have not stayed at Amerilis, why? What are you waiting for? <laughs> why would you pick another hotel? Like, seriously? Like, seriously? Like, seriously? Seriously. <laughs> why? Like, I don't know. I don't know, man. You come, to, you come to Blanta and you decide to go to another hotel? Really? No, mate. No, mate. No. If you are sitting in another hotel now, <laughs> check out. <laughs> Pause this video, check out, and then come to a very list, okay? You won't regret you, you will not regret it. Okay, let me tell you guys what I personally love about a Marilis, and hopefully that will I don't know, get you excited about a Marilis as well, so that the next time that you're in Blanta, you decide to make this the hotel of your choice. All right, number one. Do, 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 do. Drum roll. Okay, number one, I absolutely love that Emeritus is in the center of town, literally. Like, it, that just, I mean, that already says a lot because there's nothing like getting into a city and then having to drive like 20 minutes away to get to a hotel. And the hotel might be beautiful, but the driving time though, so Amaryllis is like right in the center of town, which which is amazing. You can literally walk out of the hotel and you've got steers at the back. You've got so you've got restaurants in like very close vicinity. You've got town, the market, shops, everything is like right like five, ten minutes uh walking distance away and even shorter if you're driving. So that I think that is a great like that is like number one, one of the number one things that you look for uh when you're looking for a hotel. Or at least that's what I would look for. If I'm in a city, I I don't want to have to drive 20 30 minutes out of town to get to the things that i need to get to i want my hotel to be um within you know close 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 what's the word <laughs> close parameters hey english can fail you sometimes i want it to be within close parameters to the different things that i need to get done so amaryllis gives you that um number two number two number two number two i love amaryllis's cosmopolitan vibe yo english <laughs> i love amaryllis's uh cosmopolitan vibe i was speaking to um somebody the other day and we were talking about another hotel that i will not mention its name but basically we were just saying that like when you compare these two hotels amaryllis is like your more modern it's like your what do they call them these days it's like your sleigh queen it's like your you know vibey person it's like your millennial that's what emeritus is uh compared to your other traditional uh hotels especially within malawi so that's what i love about emeritus because it's got a bunch of things going on it's not just a sleeping place you've got 
you know, shops, you've got restaurants, you've got salons, you've got a bunch of things going on in the hotel. And if you like that kind of vibe, then this is definitely um, a hotel that you would enjoy because within the hotel itself, it's got all of those things going on that I mentioned. So I absolutely love that because, hello, hi, you can tell that me too, I'm a cosmopolitan chick. <laughs> you can see that I'm also your millennial. Um, am I a millennial? I don't know. I always get confused about these generational things. I don't know. But yeah, you can see that I'm also like, you know, yeah, with the times. So that's why I love, I love Emeritus because it's just, it, it suits the brand, right? Let me know in the comment section down below if you agree. <laughs> number three, number three, number three, number three. Um, I absolutely love that Amarilis partners with a bunch of different artists, organizations, um, and brands. I think I've mentioned this now a number of times. <laughs> and you might hear me mentioning it several times after this because we don't have enough of that here in Malawi. Ndijani. A Malawi Ndijani. Ndijani. <laughs> Currently, the president is running a campaign that I think needs to go on even beyond Cyclone Freddy. We need... Listen, I'm trying not to get emotional on this video, okay? But I, I am like, I could preach a sermon on this thing. I feel like as Malawians, we do not support each other enough. We do not collaborate enough. We do not understand the power of brands coming together and creating beautiful things. Um, and Amarilis has latched onto that thing. Amarilis has understood that thing. And I see them doing the things so many times. I've heard so many different people in the content creation space, um, so many different artists, so many people just in the media kind of industry um, talking about Amarilis and their general manager and how amazing it is to be able to work with them. So I really just give them a huge round of applause for doing that and i really hope that they will really pioneer kind of more of that um, within malawi where we will see more brands working together we will see hotels and even other brands working with small content creators small business owners um just working with artists and just giving platforms for people in different industries um to collaborate and work with them so big ups to you amaryllis for doing the things in that regard which brings me to number four, number four, number four, number four. Okay, if you know me, if you really know me, you know that I'm a foodie. I enjoy food so much. Listen, my body doesn't respond to food <laughs> the way that you would think that it, it, it should. If I tell you guys about all my unhealthy eating habits, hmm, you're going to judge me. You're going to judge me. And I was scratching my head because I was like, hey... Must I really expose myself? Because, yeah, I be eating cake, like, all the time. And, like, bad things that you mustn't put in your body. Like, huh, less of the vegetables and, like, more of the sweet things. Yeah, that's me all the time. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, if, if you are a foodie like me, then listen. Emeritus is the place to be because they've got plenty of food options. Listen, I have not even been able to explore all of them because there's just a lot going on. So, you've got Splash. You've got... Um, steak out, you've got Zafran. I don't know if they've got other restaurants within the building, but then there's also food lovers if you just want to quickly like walk into a store and get like already prepped food. There's just, there's a lot of options, okay? Which I feel like, again, is not common in Malawi. I could be wrong. Maybe I just haven't been to that many hotels, but the ones that I have been to don't have that wide, that much of a wide range of eating places and different types of food that you can get within the hotel itself. So that's one thing that I absolutely love about this place because I'm just like, listen, when I come to that hotel, I want to try this and I'll try that and I'll try this and I'll try that. So if you are a big food lover, then listen. You got to come to this place. Even if you're not coming to stay, but you're just coming to, you know, explore the different restaurants. I think that that's something that you should do. And finally, finally, number five, number five, number five. Hey, hey. Okay, I'm getting a little bit carried away. <laughs> number five, I absolutely love the views. Uh, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. However they built this place, they were smart. Whoever their architect was, the plan that they had for this place just absolutely stunning um because if you're staying you know in the room even if you're just like by the splash restaurant and you're looking out you get this beautiful view uh, and landscape of the city which is just like top notch really um so i absolutely love that you can walk out of your room and you've got a balcony and you've got this beautiful beautiful views um of of just the Blantyre city which i think is beautiful that's like one of those things uh who if you are into nature into landscape and just things like that um then 
yeah it's like a plus it's like a plus 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 <laughs> so yeah guys i hope that you enjoyed this video and i really do hope that the next time that you're in blanta you choose a married list because like i said it's a beautiful place um there's so many other things that i can talk about their pool oh my goodness their pool <laughs> um i can talk about their rooms which i also think are really nice um there's a lot really um but these are the five things that i thought okay let me share these five things with my people people so that the next time that you're at a married list you yeah rather the next time that you're in blanta you choose to stay at a married list all right honeys thank you so much for watching this video please share it with a friend like if you know somebody coming to malawi coming to blanta specifically share it with them and be like hey check out this hotel that this youtuber talked about um and comment in the section down below have you stayed at a married list before if so what is one thing that you love about a married list and if not what is the one thing that you definitely want to experience now that you've watched and heard me talk about what is the one thing that I've said that you're going to want to come and experience here at a Meredith Hotel? Let me know in the comment section down below. I cannot wait to hear all the amazing things that you're going to say. Thank you once again for watching my video. I love you guys. Bye. And God bless you. Don't forget to do the things that I always tell you to do. Like this video. Share it with a friend. Comment in the section down below. Subscribe. Turn on your notification bells. Do the things that you must do. Bye.